when you're making certain types of music, you might want to add some distortion to a vocal. Maybe not to destroy it, but certainly to uh, warm it up, give it a bit of grit, a little bit of an edge. And as we saw a little bit earlier, you can add Line 6 guitar or bass amp modules to any vocal track. Uh, you could also try a Scream 4 distortion. Now, experience tells me that this is going to be really loud, so I'm going to just turn everything down initially and then play. You can choose a preset, of course. Uh, you can also experiment with these settings on the front. You change the distortion type, and then the cut section changes, like the EQ, and the body controls the shape of the sound. So let's just hope this isn't too loud. Oh, good. So some are worse than others. Overdrive, distortion, and fuzz, they're all pretty heavy, but tube is uh, a bit easier, and it kind of warms the sound up without destroying it. Electrostatic, pop addict, let's hit the club tonight, originated. So, you know, maybe for this kind of music, you wouldn't do this so much, but it certainly works for various different types of music. Tape. Trend hater, you set the place alight. So it doesn't have to necessarily mean destroying a vocal, although you can do that if you want. Uh, you can just kind of warm it up. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. Superstar, superstar, superstar. You could turn off any of these sections. You can use one, two, or all three of them if you want. So uh, that's a very quick guide to warming up a vocal with a little bit of Scream 4. <laughs> 